Welcome to Art Bites, Short Encounters with the Collection of the Mariana Kistler Beach Museum of Art. I'm Catherine Slogic. I'm the Associate Curator of Education at the museum, and I will be your host today. Um, in honor of Women's History Month, I'd like to feature a work by Colette Bangert. It's called Inland Seasons, Haze 4. Um, Colette Bangert was um, trained um, in uh, as a classical artist, as a traditional artist, but her style evolved into these abstract landscapes with repetitive patterns um, with slight variations. Um, they're reminiscent of leaves, of trees, of grasses, um, and they spread across large expanses um, with these repetitive patterns. She says she's exploring sameness and similarity in the texture and form, while at the same time things change. I kind of think of it like a field of grass. Um, each blade of grass is pretty much the same, but as the wind blows, those grasses have different patterns. Um, it re creates really an irregular um, repetition. And I have added some detail shots so that you can really look and see how her lines work. Um, Colette met her husband, Jeff Bangert, um, in um, um, Boston. She was at Boston University working on her MFA and he was at Harvard and was a mathematician. Um, later, Jeffrey was employed at the University of Kansas and the couple was, and he was given a plotter um, to test out. And so they began to work with it um, graphically. Now, the plotter works by taking the paper and moving it forward. And then the pen, the drafting pen moves from left to right. And so the two combine their skills um, to use the machine for drawing. Um, and um, when they would do these together, they would sign them CB. Um, the idea was to take um, Colette's idea of landscape and program that into these irregular patterns. Um, as the Renaissance of computer art um, sort of blossomed, the Bangerts became a key part of this movement. Um, and um, Colette wrote that without conscious understanding of what a drawing is, we could not use the computer as a drawing medium. We ask this new medium questions and get new and old answers. But some of the answers were there from the beginning. Um, they did the plotter drawings. This is a series called the Plain Series, where they were working more with color. And their final series, um, which was Plain Series 2, um, combined the idea of the color and the plotter. And that was generated in 2012. And that was their last sort of computer work together. Jeffrey passed away in 2019. Colette continues to work in her Lawrence studio in a variety of media, including textiles. Um, the work in the old media continues to um, reflect the algorithmic um, approach that she and her husband had. So the collaboration with her husband has trained her to always think about what she is drawing. Um, and you can see here um, two more pieces from our collection, white coil covered and the blue curves ochre. Um, and again, you can see the lines and the patterns that are part of these works. As we take a final look at Inland Seasons, consider these words written by Colette in 1975, but still quite apparent in her later work. Now I am beginning to see what a line is about to see that I can choose to draw little lines, a one big sweep of the arm line, a coiled or an uncoiled line, crossing lines, spiraled lines, random lines, and it is all the same line. Where and how these lines are placed in color make the drawing what it is. Um, the composition is perhaps the truly difficult element in the making of a drawing. Thank you so much for joining me um, and um, looking at the work of Colette Bangert. <laughs>